I'm letting out some line here. The Canon Fowershot SD1100 is on the cap rig, attached well below the Flowform 16 kite. And I'm just lofting it out over the water. I'm backing up fast here because I'm losing the wind, letting out too much line too fast. So I'm bringing it back over land in case it comes down faster than I wanted it to. I took these videos after I took the images that are in the photosynth called uh, Below Pine Hill. I just did a little touch and go there just for fun. I just wanted to see how this video looked from the little teeny camera. The photosynth images were taken with a power shot A590. And I'm just walking along the edge of the pond to keep the camera out over the water just for fun. You can hear the cord rolling through the pulleys on the Pika Bay suspension. This was all done on May 26th. I haven't gotten around to doing anything with these images until now. I'm in a little hurry to get back behind this tree. In case I lose the wind, I can run upwind. But the wind was pretty good. And now I'm going to start to let out some line. I'm letting it out a little bit too fast here, so it's swinging the cap rig and jerking the camera around. You can see the rock in the middle of the pond that shows up in the photosynth. Now the camera's up high enough that it's experiencing the conditions that it was when it was taking the photosynth, photosynth images. And it was only taking one image per position as the auto cap controller positioned the camera. And it kind of explains why I wasn't able to stitch together very many of the images in a continuous panorama. Now I'm just running up the hill again to show off.